Hello and welcome back to an episode 5 of the long haul. I am Metal Bro, streaming live on Twitch for those who want to join and chat and interact with me. It is daytime, I've been just doing my thing overnight. Thankfully no crashes unlike last time. Got myself a new stone, uh, stone axe and and a new iron club, so that is wonderful stuff. I'm out of wood though, so. Um, so in today's episode, we're. Well, I'm just trying to get stuff crafted up. We do have some zombies in the. The crack a book, I'm thinking. Let's go raid the. You know, raid these couple houses over here. So I do have some jars that need to be filled up, so. Um, do you gotta be careful because today is a dog day. So, what I'm actually gonna do is I'm actually gonna take those rounds out of the pistol. There's, I didn't unload the SMG. I do have the SMG schematic, so got over 400 rounds of of SMG and, and power, so. Wonderful stuff. Let's go take care of the the good old uh, the good old the good old boys over here. Um, but yeah, just gotta be careful, dogs. Nancy, you've been you've been busy overnight. Um, here's your reward. <laughs> uh, actually, wind up beating in with the the gold fashioned. Uh, old-fashioned um, stone axe. Then again, I don't know if dogs will actually spawn over here because last dog day I had, it's like a uh, song Get Rich or Die. That series, uh, the previous series I did for single player. Bob's being a little difficult. He's the one to get clubbed. Well, too bad, buddy. Yeah, what the hell. Well, I at least want to make a new uh, bed roll. See if we can. Because even if the dogs do come, I I'm not too afraid of them at the moment. Just would be nice to have. To me, it's like more XP, and they can they can be the first ones to experience the rad tata of the SMG. Just gotta click some more wood. And it came around around the corner. Come here. You get to you get the fun experience of losing your head. Actually, uh, I don't know if that's a, entirely fun, but oh well. I digress. That's what you enjoy, Annie. And, and then um, uh, lose your head by all means. I should. Yeah, you know, well, like uh, after going raid the neighborhood, well, the like the wealthy home over there and. Uh, Probably not gonna go breaking into the safes, so, but uh, what I want to do is I want to go and um, I want to go and try and find some coal because I got plenty of nitrate last night. So, oh, more stone axes. Uh, more stone axes. Don't mind those. It's like that's the remnants from the. Crafting overnight, like uh, doing tool smithing, um, and that I had to fill up the duffel bag full of, and the and the corpse uh, up here full of stone axes. Like I crafted like 130 kind of stone axes, something like that. But let's place a new bedroll down. That way, if I somehow die, I don't go respawning over at the at the gold fashioned. Uh, Cracker book that we first found. But anyways, while I'm last time, waiting for that to craft over, uh, got it here for you on YouTube, and I will meet you uh, at the wealthy house over to the east. Alrighty, we are coming up on the old uh, wealthy uh, home to get my uh. Bedroll place down. Thankfully, dogs didn't immediately spawn, but we got 
some uh, good old fashioned uh, braiding to do in here. Take these for leather. And nothing there. Um, scrap the press boy cap down for cloth. Take, take care of whoever's in the yard. Or they might be in the backyard, for all I know. Uh, I would have grabbed some water if I. Oh! It's curly! Yeah, I was just telling, like, you know, those who are on Twitch watching, I call this big dude Curly because, uh, he's. It's like, uh. I call him Curly because he's a. Because his name and, like, his name in the files is, uh, is Mo. It's like, uh. It's, so it's like, uh. I call him Curly because it's like, you know, it's a reference to the old school Three Stooges. Like, uh. If you don't know who they are, it's like. A you know, comedy group from back in the day, like, very well known if you don't know them. Like. I'm not saying if you don't know them, like, you're, you're dumb. Oh! A little bit of a flood. Marla has had a little bit of spillover. <laughs> Come here. Ow! Damn. Oh. Marla, are you gonna get up? Couldn't see you. Ow. Oh, her infection. I'm not worried, I got some other antibiotics or the popping pills yesterday, so. We'll take care of that later. I'm really not worried about it. Don't want to worry about the old-fashioned, uh... Dust safe, that's not really high on my list. Don't really plan on reading it. Sink. Wow, well, lost the glass jars, as per usual. Um... Someone inside the house? Hello? Oh, leather. Oh, hi, Penny. Was that your favorite chair? I'm sorry, sweetie. There you go. A little bit of club to the face, so we'll, we'll do you good. Come here. Nancy, 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 Nancy. Yeah, I got a, a challenge off screen, though, the lady killer, so. Hey, we, we leveled up. Yeah, I got a couple uh, extra little... What are the skill points to spend? Uh, might invest that into toolsmithing uh, later on tonight, like uh, just to help out and you know, get closer to that higher level, well, to that level 500 toolsmithing. So, okay, just raiding the old kitchen here. Before I forget, I need to go raid the the bookshelf that's hidden under the, in the staircase. It's like, sometimes I forget about that, and, but never know what that might contain. Um, that's all taken care of. We'll just grab that leather. Um, there we go. Almost done. Alrighty. Bookcase, what you got? Alien schematic and some paper. Paper's always welcome. I will always take it. And for the... And then, doors unlocked. Don't worry about the bed for now. I'll start scrapping stuff down. There we go. All the iron is coming together. There we go. All the all that's done. I'll just break into this, and then we'll go we'll go hunting for coal. I think I can find it in the the winter biome. If I get more coal, then I can get more gunpowder. Means more blunderbuss fun. Ooh, football helmet. I will actually keep that for a mining helmet. Once I eventually get the uh, the mining helmet. That's all done. Check on our construction tools. Actually, we are at the level uh, nine out of that. So. Wonderful stuff. I searched you. Alrighty, guys. Uh, let's go over to the winter biome and go looking for some coal. 
Yeah, hey, YouTube, just get, grabbing up coal here. Had to travel a decent little trek. Uh, had to travel across the winter biome, and before I started finding coal, I like, went up north, you know. Had a little sidetrack, fought some lumberjacks and everything. That's like, found more nitrate and find, found a good amount of coal so far, so. And. So, what I'm actually going to do is, because I'm. Yep, there's even more coal over here. So, I'm just going to grab this coal pile over. These two coal piles over here, and then I'm going to head back over to town and meet you over there. Alrighty, you two, we're back in town here. As I can see, we're coming up on a crack book base, and because uh, it is dog day, in case you don't know what dog day is, it happens two days before every horde. Uh, so, take example, uh, day seven is uh, the first horde, so usually uh, on day five there's a dog day, and and so there should be a, a dog horde uh, coming over. Just gotta keep an eye out for them. It's like it usually happens. They usually spawn in once you have a, once you're in range of your bed roll. Like once it's actually in range. I don't know if we actually avoided the dog day because like I had, I did have a a bed roll over here. Let me see over at the crack book on this crossroad. So it's like, I don't know if it activated over there. Just be safe, let's just throw on the old the old hatch. Yeah, we're looking safe over for now. Hints on for now. Um, I could use a bit more wood, but eat a little bit of food. <laughs> Forgot to eat before heading out. Or in the day, but hey, that means more wellness. That's how I see it. More wellness gains, and, and don't worry about the water. We're we're fine. Just get our wellness up. Um, and I've gotten over a thousand coal, so like eleven hundred coal and uh, three hundred sixty-four nitrate. So not the most amount in the world, but. Um, more blunderbuss ammo for me, but, uh, got 500 nitrate. The nitrate's a big limiting factor on this, so let's actually go and, yeah, we'll just convert all that over to gunpowder. I'm just gonna let it craft for a while just to, um, let me actually just split this up. There we go. Um, two more pieces of wood, and that should be fine. It'll take a little bit, but not too worried about it. It's a. I'll just refine that down into gunpowder later. So I know the episode is a little bit. I'm probably looking a little light on time. So let's just. Uh, I'm just gonna throw some stuff in here for. For the time being, we'll, I'll eventually get this uh, all organized and looking pretty. But let's go and just check, the, just check the area for dogs. Like my bedrolls there. Because I don't know if like the dog dog horde will be spawning this time around, but they very well could have. The game very well could have uh, just tripped over the. Uh, dog horde over there and like it was just waiting for me to go back over there but eh, we're look I think we're looking okay probably forget anything though I need some glass jars come here where's the glass jars because can I at least use that for making making murky well grabbing murky water yeah that's how dog words work it it works. It's interesting how it is, but it's like that's how I know they work. They uh, 
the game will spawn a dog horde and and uh, a horde of dogs uh, two days before every horde. So not gonna let my guard down until day five is over, because sometimes the dogs are very quiet and they can sneak up on me. I figured you. Just stand out the day here. Let's raid this a little bit. Um, I could break through that little gap there, but eh, I'd rather break through the door. Be a civilized folk. Open the door. I guess as civilized you can be in the zombie apocalypse. Another football helmet. Yeah, I did find a a flashlight on my little journey to find coal, and so. Looking better on that, and so it's like once I get my construction tools up, which actually I was thinking about investing it into investing it into the the what do you call it the, the gold fashion uh, into toolsmithing, you know, help myself get to higher tool levels faster. And I'm like, well, wait a minute. I could actually just go in and uh, make a make myself a little bit of a. I could just uh, help myself a little bit by investing a little bit into into construction tools, get that workbench going a little bit faster. Um, actually, just checking the stats. White tank tops actually better, so. Scrap that down for cloth. More paper needs more blunderbuss ammo. You see paper, I see blunderbuss. Should mean that, which reminds me, like uh, I should grab some clay here a little bit. I figured, just you know, want to do a little bit of looting, a little bit more. And we'll just scrap that. Another toilet pistol. Spoilers, <laughs> well, I didn't find toilet pistols for a long time, and then it's like, now the game is it just kind of. I don't know if it's because I'm streaming this live on Twitch or what, but uh, now the game just feels like giving me toilet pistols more often. More pistol parts. Scrap that down for iron. Corn and water. More lead. It's like I also did find a bunch of bullet tips, which I'll gladly take those for, like, uh, eventually when I need to start making 9 mil ammunition for the SMG. You know, I got 400 rounds, uh, like 450 rounds. I want to make sure I just keep an eye on the ammo reserves and, you know, just make sure they're all looking good. Um, that's looking fine. Beat into the store. There we go. Charlie, what you got for me, buddy? Nada. A lot of times you have nothing, a lot of times you have magnum parts. Um, looking okay in here. Break into this. And. Shouldn't take too long. A couple of bookshelves. See if it has anything good for me in there. Um, sledgehammer schematic. Very nice. More paper. And then we got all that. Okay. That's all read, so I think that's going to be about the, it for today's episode, everyone on YouTube. So I hope you all enjoyed. I'm going to go do some clay collecting for my forge. That way it doesn't. That way I don't run out of clay overnight, and then, uh, I'm gonna, I'll pick up with you guys in, on in the morning of day six. Have a great day, and take care.